here in Rowan County this morning with Chris Charest with Culp Lumber Company. Chris, thank you for inviting us out here to this site today. We've been all around the state of North Carolina looking at a lot of different forestry practices. And here today, we're on site where I understand a clear cutting's taking place. And in the forest industry, security is a very important issue this day. Can you tell us a little bit how you track the wood that comes off this property and the new technology that's been introduced to this industry? Yes, sir, uh, appreciate you coming out here. About three years ago, Culp Lumber Company teamed up with a software company called Legna Software out of Winston-Salem, North Carolina. The goal of it was to bring data real time for loggers, mills, landowners, and consultants. What we have done is we have placed tablets or phones in every loader of our loggers. They create the ticket in the woods. Every ticket is geocoded and immediately sends me or a mill owner, a forester, landowner, consultant, a geotag of where that load was created to make sure it was created in the right spot. At the same time, that load is immediately uploaded to our scale house. He's waiting for that load to arrive, knowing that load's on its way. Um, this also allows the logger to look at his information real time. Mm -hmm. As soon as it's scaled into the scale house, he can pull up that load, look at the weight the truck weighed, know his weights, know where, how long his truck driver took there. Um, but it has created a layer of security for mills to make sure that loads are coming from where they are. And for landowners and consultants to make sure that mills pay the right landowner for the right loads on unit sales. Um, a lot of it wasn't malicious activity. It was contract truckers, truckers um, saying wrong tickets, um, which would cause an accounting headache for mills or for payees to go back and say, oh, well, this ticket has the wrong name. I got to correct it. I got to do yeah. this. This has allowed us to look at data in real time and make sure that we are receiving logs from where they're mm -hmm. supposed to, and we are paying the right people for the logs they're supposed to, um, and it's taken a lot of the accounting out of truck driver's hands. Uh, now you're relying on the boss logger uh, to get the information right, and we can see in real time whether it's right or correct uh, what's going on. Well, that's fascinating technology, no doubt about it. It's so different than it was years ago, where you just have logging sheets and the, the, the trucker filled out when he yeah, left. Yes, sir. But that's, like you said, not only great accounting for the mill, but also for the landowner, too, to know that his wood is going where it was purchased. And where we want to take this software to when we're partnering with Legna is we want the consultants and even the landowners to be able to access a portal yeah. live. And during the week, they can pull up and say, hey, this many tons of saw logs, this many tons of pulp wood. Um, and that way they can track, the consultant can track, hey, well, why is this sort going this way, that way? Make sure he's getting his chip and saw. Make sure they're getting their oak and poplar. Yeah. Um, the next level we're taking it is when a truck driver goes to a pulp wood mill, he immediately takes a picture of the ticket from the pulp wood mill and it uploads it live. And you can see pictures of tickets as they happen in real time. real time. So the data is there as the week progresses and you can see what your accounting is anytime you pull up the portal. Well, that's it, fascinating. So I can do that as a landowner. Yes. I can look at what's coming off my property, the volume, the, the timber mix, the species mix, and I yeah. got that. I don't have to wait for a, a letter coming from the mill. Yeah, I can that, do it real time. That is the goal of the software. We're not wow. there yet, but things take time to develop. But that yeah. is part of the partnership goal is to allow is the data is there. It's always been there. Mm -hmm. But instead of a ticket getting caught in a truck driver's shoe <laughs> or lost in a, yeah. a McDonald's bag and the mill says, hey, wait a minute, why did I never pay the logger for these tickets? All the stuff is there live and can be paid live and uh, calculated live and the information can be shared throughout the whole accounting process. Wow, that is so fascinating, so groundbreaking. Um, how many companies do you think are adopting this technology yet? Well, I know we started with Legna three years ago. Um, they have signed on with several independent saw mills mm -hmm. in the Piedmont region, North Carolina. Um, they've signed on with several wood dealers um, down in Georgia. Um, they're in Mississippi. They're, they're trying to basically um, work the southeast area, and, and it's a growing technology. Uh, mills are seeing the advantage of it. Mm -hmm. Um, and hopefully consultants and landowners and loggers will eventually see the land uh, the advantage of it. My loggers now, like I said, they don't have to wait for the truck to get back to say, oh, I loaded him overweight. They know, hey, I need to back off or I need to add more logs. Um, they can see 
what they do throughout the week, their load sheet there is kept on the tablet. They can pull it up and see all the information. They can see if one truck driver is pulling over on the side of the road and taking 30 minutes longer to get to the mill than the others. It tells them, it tells them, hey, this load left the deck at 10 o'clock and arrived at the mill at 11. They know their round trip time. They can see all their data live. Well, this sounds like cutting edge technology in the forest industry. Chris, thank you so much for sharing this information with us. We certainly appreciate it. And thank you again for letting us come out here to this site today. No problem. I'm Red Davis with the North Carolina Tree Farm Program.